Question number four says that a triangle and a parallelogram have got the same base and the same area. If the sides of the triangle are 26 centimeters, 28 centimeters, and 30 centimeters, and the parallelogram stands on the base 28 centimeters, we have to find the height of the parallelogram. So let's first draw a triangle ABC with side lengths 26 centimeters, 30 centimeters, and 28 centimeters. And as given in the question, the parallelogram stands on the base, which has got the side length 28 centimeters. So let's draw a parallelogram there. Name it BEDC. Let H be the height, let BF be the height of the parallelogram, which stands perpendicular to the base ED. So we will have to find the length of ED as well, which will be equal to 28 centimeters as sides opposite to each other in a parallelogram are equal in length. Now we will have to find the area of triangle ABC so that it can be equated to the area of parallelogram BEDC. So we make use of the Heron's formula as the side lengths for the triangle ABC are given but its height is not given. So area A equals under root S times S minus A times S minus B times S minus C where S is the semi-perimeter while ABC are the three side lengths of a given triangle. So we will first have to find the semi-perimeter for triangle ABC and that can be found by adding up its three side lengths and dividing it by 2. So we start adding 26 plus 28 plus 30 centimeters and let's divide that by 2. So on calculation we get the semi-perimeter S for triangle ABC to be equal to 42 centimeters. Now we can find the area of triangle ABC by substituting these values back into the Heron's formula. So we write under root 42 times 42 minus 26 times 42 minus 28 times 42 minus 30 centimeter square. This one further calculation comes as under root 42 times 16 times 14 times 12 centimeter square. This on further calculation gives us that the area of triangle ABC equals 336 centimeter square. Now that we have found out the area of triangle ABC, let's equate it to the area of parallelogram BEDC to find its height. So we write area of parallelogram BEDC to be equal to the area of triangle ABC. Now we know that the formula to find the area of a parallelogram is base into height so we equate B times H to the e area of triangle ABC which is 336. As the value for base is 28, let's substitute that. We write 28 times H equals 336. So H equals 336 divided by 28. So we get the height for the parallelogram BEDC to be equal to 12 centimeters. And this is the correct answer for this question. To learn more about how QMath can help you crack school and board exams, explore QMath Leap, a live online classroom program run by highly experienced and committed teachers.